Oh, where am I? I've got a splitting headache. I've got to concentrate. Hello everyone, it's Robotic Zombie. Welcome back. Oh, hello, Bat. <laughs> Welcome back to Vampireville. So, last time, as we are determining the different blood types of more residents in the castle, we got knocked out by Ellen's father, who was very upset that we were in his yard. So, now we need to find the differences between the left screen and the right side of the screen. So, let's get to it. Okay. Clear vision. At last I found you. Uh, Brandon almost killed me. Yes, Brandon's out of control. Now he is threatening that girl, the nurse. We're at our wit's end. Is there any way to calm him down? There is one thing he hates. He was bitten by a yellow spider when he was a child. Since then, he can't stand the sight of yellow spiders. Excellent. The attic is full of spiders. Are you afraid of spiders, Glenfield? Would you like to hunt them together? Collect all the spiders. Okay. Okay, we found all the spiders. Sir, grab the spiders and let's hurry to the boiler room. <laughs> Michael, at last! Laura, are you okay? Groundsman is insane! He tied me up! Did he, by any chance, bite you? Goodness! Does he have rabies as well? No, he didn't bite me. <laughs> okay, I'll find something sharp to cut the rope. Thank you. Brandon will be here soon. We should get ready for him. How? He was bitten by a yellow spider when he was a child. Let's see what he does when he sees two huge yellow spiders. Okay. By the way, guys, I don't recommend you paint spiders. The spiders worked. Let's get a blood sample while he's out. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> eyes rolling back. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Oh, looks like he has type B blood. It's type B. 
we have to keep looking. Let's leave before he comes to. <laughs> Can you read Latin? A little bit. I studied it in medical school. I found a manuscript in the boiler room. I think it's in Latin. Take a look. Okay, let's see. Yes, it's Latin. I'll see what I can understand. Here's the gist of it. Dear Duke, 20 years ago, a baby in a basket was left at your doorstep. The baby is your nephew. He is your sister Mary's illegitimate son. I couldn't tell you the truth then. But now that the baby's all grown up, I wanted to clear my conscience. Bridget, Mary's friend, April 3rd, 1905. It must be in reference to the heir everyone's expecting. Earlier, I noticed a few scrolls with the Malgrave family tree. They must still be somewhere here in the library. Find the scrolls. Okay, found all the scrolls. These are all the family records I could find. Now I have to organize them. Find the ancestors of the characters shown in the left column. Shown in the left column. Okay. Well, there's Mary. Okay. Here are the ancestors of the Duke, Glenfield, even Mary. But the groundsman doesn't have ancestors. How strange. So, young man, searching through old books again, are we? Duke, so glad to see you. What can you tell me about the groundsman? Why aren't there any records about his ancestors? That's because nobody knows anything about them. He was left on our doorstep when he was a baby. The note in the basket only informed us that his name is Brandon. It happened in... Mm, 1886. I remember this very well, because it happened just after my sister's tragic death. Was your sister's name Mary? Yes. My dear Duke and Duchess, I believe I know the name of your heir. Please, gather everyone in the parlor, and I'll explain. Are you joking? I have never been more <laughs> serious. It turns out that Nurse Laura is a dear friend of mine. Who would have thought that this lovely young lady goes by the name Red Devil on the internet? <laughs> well, I guess still waters run deep. She asked me to tell you my blood type, and I couldn't refuse the Red Devil. I don't remember it, but it must be printed on my dog tags from the Great War. It's in a jewelry box somewhere. Okay, we finally got that open. <laughs> okay, that looks like A B.
Enfield's Type AB. <laughs> Finally, it's time to go to the parlor. Okay, I'll stop it here for now. And I'll get back to this very soon. Thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you later. Okay, bye. <laughs>